Hi there. My name is Leif Gregerson. I'm a blogger here at the Mental Health Stigma blog on HealthyPlace.com. I wanted to talk to you today about something that I work very hard to fight. Stigma. Um, what I wanted to talk specifically about with regards to stigma is honesty and when you can share and when you can't share the fact that you have a mental illness. Now the fact is, is that there are many times when it's not a good idea to share that you have a mental illness. But sometimes when it comes to close relationships, you may have to be honest at some point regardless. So it can often be beneficial to be honest up front. There are also some times, such as in employment, uh, where it also can be beneficial to be honest up front and other times where it isn't. I know there was one company I made an application for where they had actually a quota of people they had to hire who were disabled and so it was beneficial to them to know that I was disabled. And also another case where I was in a union and I was working hard and I was having some difficulties and I was just honest with them and I said, you know, I can't keep up. And they were very good about giving me time off to go ahead and uh, convalesce, as it were. Um, now, the last thing I wanted to talk to you about today, real quickly, was um, the importance of family members and friends. And about the fact that this once again comes in about honesty. Because when you're with family members and friends, um, especially friends who suffer from other mental illnesses, or even just old friends who, who care about you, uh, when you're with these people, you don't have to put up a mask, you don't have to worry about stigma, and so it's very important to keep these relationships strong. So that's just something I wanted to share with you. Um, I know I, I teach a group uh, of writing students who have mental health difficulties, and the most important things that comes up with them all the time is family and friends, and without them, life can be very difficult. So I hope you got something out of this video and I thank you for watching and I also hope you have a wonderful day and a great summer. Thanks. Bye.